Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back for more Let's Play Legend of Zelda Oracle Seasons. In the last episode, we got the fifth essence of nature. Um, I w first thing I want to say is if you uh, don't have it already or you had a light light ticket and forgot to kill the light light to get it, go to uh, Horan Village and uh, pick up a shield there. You can also get another one somewhere else that I'll mention as soon as we get there. So... But anyway, what we want to do is we want to utilize this uh, underground path that we have used on multiple occasions. So go ahead and go to it. And we got to pick up a few uh, things because we are going to be upgrading uh, the sword and the shield in this one. First one being the shield that we're going to upgrade first. So, if, Like I said, if you don't have the level 1 shield, go ahead and pick it up. Because you will need it to upgrade it, so. And we're going. I think I said we're going to Sabrosia. So the qu uh, <clears throat> way I want to go is I want to go up in here and go to that portal that we s that we're passing by right now. And to do that, we have to jump off this ledge and land in the portal. So. All right. So anyway, to be able to get. The things we need because we're going to have to pick up a couple of items to be able to upgrade our uh, shield here in a second. We're going to have to pick up a couple of items. One being inside that chest right there. So, we got to go over there. So, let's go ahead and go down here. And you'll see that little barrel or whatever you want to call it over there with an the S on it. We want to use our... Where is it? Oh, here it is. Our uh, little whole thing here and I don't know why I fell down like that but anyway we want to go ahead and open this chest to get the blue ore all right so we have to get a couple ores like that uh, one being red and the other being blue so next thing I want to do actually is go ahead and dig up here you don't have to do it all it's going to be is a ring that we can uh, get appraised later so if I do that all right, so let's go ahead and jump over here. Whoops, I thought I didn't jump right. I was like, oh no, I'm about to fall down the hole. Anyway, go ahead and go across here, go across there. All right, so anyway, next thing we want to do is go ahead and go up here. And let's go this way. And we're actually going to have to go to a smithy soon after we get these things to be able to upgrade everything, so. And we need to go this way to be able to get it. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's go down here. And we're going to have to go right a few screens here. So. Go ahead and uh, jump over here. Oops. That was my bad. I did not mean to do that. Actually, probably would probably be easier just to do it like this. Go ahead and jump down here. And jump over here. There we go. So anyway, let's go ahead and pick up this... Uh, these barrels right here to get them out of the way because we're gonna have to switch over to that little barrel over there or whatever you want to call it oops I thought I was pointing the right way but I wasn't all right so we got a couple more screens we want to move over here without falling down the hole preferably all right so actually we didn't want to go that far we wanted to go down here I believe yep yeah, no we did not want to go down here I don't think I went far enough right so oops all right, so let's go this way, and here we go. Now we're where I wanted to be. So go ahead and go over here, and let's go down. All right, so to get the next ore, we're going to have to go over here. <clears throat> and we're going to go ahead to open up this chest here to get the red ore. All right, so let's go ahead and get out of here. Alright, so we want to go ahead and go this way a couple screens. So let's go ahead and go over here. Alright, so 
Now we want to go ahead and go up this way. And we're actually going to have to take these things to a uh, furnace to be able, which is right here, to be able to create what we need real quick. So we want to go up here and talk to this blue subrosion here. Yeah, red ore and blue ore. Did you come to mix the two and create hard ore? Yep. Then we'll get right on it. <coughs> okay, here it goes. Your hard ore is done. Watch out. It's hot. Alright. <clears throat> so now we got the hard ore. And if you don't recognize that, I think that was actually used in a part in Oracle of Ages where um, you had to have Link tell a uh, story to somebody. So anyway, let's go ahead and go this way. And now we're going to have to utilize this hard ore to make uh, the shield. So... Let's go ahead and go this way a couple screens. Go up here. And we're going to have to go uh, left a few screens here. So go ahead and utilize the uh, thing to go backwards again. Alright. So let's go over a couple more screens here. I think one more screen should do it. And right there, the market, um, I believe you can buy a shield in here. Yeah. Oh, no, you can't. I thought you could. I guess not. <laughs> anyway, um, like I said, just buy this shield at Horon and that would be good. I thought you could buy one in there, but apparently you can't, so forget that. <laughs> anyway, do that one want to go ahead and go this way a couple screens here. And we're going to go inside this building. Alright, so go ahead and talk to this guy right here. Welcome to the Subrosian Smithy. We do the finest work in the land, but we take on only jobs that interest us. The two in back are masters of the trade. I'm just the manager. Hmm? The master speaks. Hmm, is that so? The master misses nothing. That hard ore could make your cheap shield amazingly fine. So what will it be? Make it fine or do whatever. Tell him to do whatever. To get it. Do whatever? Say no more. Master, he says do whatever. Sorry for the wait. This is why he's a master. The finest work in all the land. Take it. Treat it like an heirloom. You got an iron shield. Alright, cool. So now we got uh, our upgraded shield. So, <clears throat> now we got to um, go ahead and make our way to... Uh, getting the um, sword, the upgraded sword. And I'll talk a little bit more about that, Al, <laughs> once we actually get to the sword area. So the first thing we want to do actually is go ahead and exit, um, I almost said Horan Village, uh, Sabrosia. So go ahead and exit. Okay, so now that we exit it, we want to go ahead and warp to uh, North Horon, so go ahead and do that. Alright, so once we work to North Horon, we want to go ahead and go this way. And right here is uh, Maple, so if you want to see if she's going to drop a piece of heart, go ahead and wait for her to come by. So, come here. Thank you, and she did not drop a piece of heart, so we're going to have to keep trying to run into her until she decides to drop a new uh, piece of heart, so... Alright, so anyway, now we want to continue going um, this way. So, And we're going to want to actually go ahead and get into the water. So go ahead and get into the water. And once you get into the water, we want to go ahead and go this way. And we want to go down a few screens. Um, there's this thing right here if you want to chop it to see if you get anything from it. And we got a ring. Nope. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and leave, but I'm going to go ahead and go ahead and pan another Gasha Seed, just in case, because we still haven't gotten that piece of heart yet. 
So then now we still gotta go down a few screens, so go ahead and keep swimming. Trying to avoid these uh, river zores the best you can. And hopefully they don't hit you while you're doing this. Which, ow. <laughs> Alright, so we wanna go ahead and go into this uh, cave right here. And speak to this guy right here. Oh, Keeper of the Essences, I have awaited your arrival. I give you this. You got the round jewel. Alright, so now we have all four jewels that we will need um, <clears throat> to be able to go to where we have to go. So let's go ahead. And now we want to warp to Spool Swamp. And we're actually getting close to where we're going to have to enter, insert those uh, jewels. So once we get to Spool Swamp, we just want to go this way. And then try and avoid the birds. Go up through this log here. And here's where we're going to insert the jewel. So go ahead and insert that one. You can insert them in any order you want, but. And then after you insert them. The door will open. So. Now that the door has opened, let's go ahead and go up here. Now we want to go ahead and turn this season to summer. Because we're going to need some vines to grow. So, and that's the only time it will do that. So go ahead and change the season to summer eventually. There we go. Alright, as soon as you turn it to summer, we want to go ahead and go up here. And avoid these um, guys around here. Oops. And we want to go ahead and go down here. And we want to push this statue real quick. Because that will make some stairs appear. But as you see, we cannot get um, into the stairs yet. So... Go ahead and go over here, avoiding these enemies again. And we want to go ahead and change the season to winter. So go ahead and do that real quick. Alright. So, now that it's winter, we want to go ahead and go this way now. And as you see, there is now uh, snow there. So we're going to want to use that to cross over here. So let's go ahead and these statues, we want to push the two bottom ones to the right. And you'll see why in just a moment, as soon as we change... The season okay and if you walk over here you will notice um actually i don't want to do that yet anyway so let's go ahead and change the season to fall real quick or autumn as they call it in here so go ahead and do that but that is the only way we can actually get into this area so go ahead and kill these guys and get them out of the way and let's go ahead and pick up this thing to get it out of the way. So go ahead and equip your, oops, your power bracelet here. And let's go in here. Alright, so there's this um, Deku Shrub guy. We want to go ahead and attack him. Or, um, actually not attack him, but let him attack us so we can bounce the seeds back just like you do in um, Ocarina of Time. I surrender in return. I offer my advice. If you're lost in the woods, travel west, then south. East and north taking each step in a warmer season hmm. so that tells us how to get through the next area we're going to be going to which actually uh, oops <laughs> actually um, if you're used to the uh, Zelda series or you're a big you're a fan of the Zelda series you will know what I mean when I talk about it here in a second as soon as I kill this guy anyway next thing we wanted to go ahead and do is um, what is the next thing we want to do, actually? Uh, oh, we want to go ahead and turn it winter because we want to um, actually get something that's going to be over there instead of those lion nails that we just fought. So, go ahead and go over here. And there is a... Well, I said lion nails. Those were uh, not lion nails. This is a lion nail. This is one of the gold creatures that we have to kill for that... Uh, guy that we talked to a while back so go ahead and kill him then we do that let's go ahead and go down here and actually I did these kind of out of order because I wanted to go speak to Deku Shrub now because that's what I wrote down but that's okay it don't matter anyway let's go ahead and go up here and let's go in this actually we want to turn it actually we do want to turn it autumn because we can't pick up those uh mushrooms without it being autumn so let's go ahead and turn it autumn real quick so now it's rain summer autumn 
right there we go there's autumn so let's go ahead and go up here because we can't pick up those uh mushrooms yet so now we can so go ahead and pick up the mushroom all right and we want to go ahead and go this way and actually we can go ahead and uh just be careful here <laughs> Because we don't want the uh, light lights to eat our shield, so just go ahead and kill them to get them out of the way real quick. And we can go ahead and blow up this wall here. And if you need it, there is a fairy in here that can heal you, so I just wanted to show that out just in case you need it. Then kill these uh, guys again. And go ahead and die, thank you. Alright, so now we want to go ahead and go down a couple screens here. And we want to go ahead and burn this bush real quick. And you'll see why in just a second. Where is my seed satchel? Where is it? Here it is. I don't know why I always get lost trying to find my items. Anyway. Alright, let's go in here and talk to this guy right here. Do do do. D? It's staring at your phonograph. Play it or don't. Yeah, go ahead and play it. D, what a lovely tune. I love it. I'll teach you the way to my secret spot. If temperatures rise as you go far to the west, you'll find it. Hmm. That's uh actually showing us how to... See, the second one was showing us how to get to the temple. This one is showing us how to get the um, next upgrade that I was mentioning that we're supposed to be getting. So... With that said and done, after we do that, let's go ahead and go this way. And let's go up this way. Just try to avoid all these uh, like likes if you can. Oh, I hate those things. Anyway, now we want to go ahead and... We want to change the season. So we want to go ahead and do winter. So go ahead and change it to winter. Where's the thing? Alright. Go left. Hop on it again. I want to do autumn, spring, and summer. So go ahead and turn it to autumn. And let's go right again, or left again. This time let's change it to spring. Go right again, uh, left again. I'm getting my directions confused. And then do summer. And go left one more time. And as you see here, there's the sword. Now, if you were doing this first before uh, Ages, Oracle of Ages, this would be the level 2 sword. But since we already have the level 2 sword because I did the uh, little secret passwords, we have the legendary Master Sword. Alright, awesome. So now that we have the sword, we want to go ahead and go this way. And as he said, we want to turn it uh make the temperatures go down so we want to start with winter of course we want to go this way oh wait, actually i'm sorry i don't know why i did why i did that um want to be winter and we want to go this way sorry and then we want to turn it to autumn you almost got lost oh that was what i was going to mention um this is the lost woods so i forgot i mentioned that so yeah like i said if you're uh are a Zelda fan then um, this place would be very familiar to you because it's in pretty much every um, Zelda game there is so that's why I was gonna say that and last we want to do summer and then head up all right while we're in here we want to try to avoid all these little statues here and keep heading up a few screens here And then once we get up here, we want to go ahead and go this way. And we want to change the season to uh, summer. And we're al actually almost to the um, to the uh, dungeon now. So let's go ahead and get this guy out of our way. Alright, so let's go ahead and go this way. And now this tree has warp seeds, so go ahead and chop them. Because that will create you a warp point if you, ever, if you want to go buy potions. Or the uh, secret potion or... From uh, the witch or get it from maple or however you want to do that so let's go ahead and go this way we want to change the season to autumn now so go ahead and change it to autumn 
and we want to go ahead and go this way and we want to go inside this bush over here so go ahead and pick up these um, mushroom things and go ahead and light uh, this bush on fire and go inside of it all right go ahead and open this chest for oh, not burn it <laughs> open it for a gosh seed all right so let's go ahead and get out of here and now we want to go back to where we changed the season we want to actually change the season to winter this time so go ahead and quit your rod right now there we go and let's go ahead and change it to winter all right so we want now that it's winter we want to go ahead and go down here and go this way get out of our way please thank you and actually there is going to um, if you dig around enough there actually is a soft soil patch around here that you can plant um, your seed in which is right there so you can go ahead and plant a gossip seed for another chance to get the um, piece of heart so let's go ahead and go up here a couple screens avoiding all these dark nuts the best we can oops I was being stupid there <laughs> anyway next thing we want to do is go ahead and go up these steps and we want to go this way and we want to push this statue out of the way so go ahead and push it and jump down all right so now we want to mess with the season again die please thank you and this time we want to actually turn the season to spring so go ahead and change it to spring oops i accidentally changed it again that was my fault so let's go ahead and change it back to spring again there we go so now it is spring go ahead and hop in the flower oh, I thought I got in the flower I guess not and go ahead and go this way oh yeah um, uh, just be careful about this thing right here because um, inside this thing is actually uh, evil man who will take some rupees from you so don't talk to him I just wanted to show that off anyway now let's go ahead and walk this way a couple screens and we will be in front of the dungeon so let's go ahead and enter and here we are level six ancient ruins so next time we will take on this dungeon so until then thank you for watching everybody and have a great day